Hey guys, uh, Gordon Cockerpunk here. Um, I uh, wanted to show you guys this video because, uh, you know, I just uploaded the old guns tour for the uh, LCD Angel, which uh, I got right here. Uh, again, uh, more in the condition that I would actually play with it in. Um, with the on off and the low rise and the halo and all that. Um, <clears throat> but, uh, I wanted to show you guys how I fixed it because I feel like I'm freaking MacGyver. Uh, <laughs> on this thing. It's actually a pretty sweet deal. Uh, let me take off loader and tank and all that jazz. Well, okay, I'll leave the tank on here. First thing you'll notice is uh, I didn't buy a lucky board for it. Uh, this is the stock board still in here. Um, but you'll notice these wires are coming out. This is because, I'll show you guys. It's so jury-rigged that it doesn't even have an on-off switch. It actually, uh... this wire in here. Oh, shit. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Good deal. So... You can see there, we're on safe mode, backlight's on, um, battery's at about three quarters. Um, so I'll switch this guy into fire mode. So, I totally got this gun working. You can hear the noid click. It cycles and everything like that. <laughs> I got it working without the uh, without the stock battery. I'll show you guys how. I wanted to show you that it does indeed work because just showing you how I did it, I might end up breaking it. So <laughs> we'll find out. Uh, what I did was I found uh, online. I was searching for building a new, my own battery pack for it that I could possibly use uh, a new charger on. And so <clears throat> what I found is. That uh, one, two, three size batteries. Um, that one, two, three size batteries will fit inside this tube here, and so uh, and one, two, three batteries are three volt batteries, which most batteries are only uh, one and a half volts, and so like for batteries like a nine volt, that's actually just six one and a half volt cells. Um, <coughs> And so I found these one, two, three batteries, and they fit in the tube, and they're three volts each. So you only need two of them, because this is a six volt gun. Um, yeah, there might be some danger involved with this situation. <laughs> so I only need to, needed to wire together two of them, but uh, it's very difficult to solder to a battery, if anybody's ever tried that, and making my own little battery harness not gonna work so well. Not to mention I don't I have a soldering iron but I don't have any solder. I have to go out and buy that. So what I did was come on. Come on. So what I did was Yeah, here we go. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh. Let's hope I didn't break it. Okay, so here you can see the two one, two, three size batteries. There's two of them. I can't even pull it out all the way because otherwise uh, I will pull the wires out from back here because this sits in the in the in the gun right here, and then it's wired back to the board here. And these guys are just packing taped together, and then I used. <laughs> This is a donut uh, or, or something of that nature, just tin that one of my roommates bought, and uh, so I built a connection from this side all the way up to this side because it was, uh, sorry, uh, with with that tin, with that metal tin, to make the connection back to the front of the battery. So now, okay, let's see if I broke it or not. I hope I didn't. I really hope I didn't. Oh, I think I did. Duh, shit. Well, see, now it's a very good thing. Oh, okay, yeah, I see what I did. Oh, that's not a bad repair, though. 
Okay, see what happened is uh, this hole is where one of the leads attaches and uh, it's obviously not attached there right now. <laughs> so I'll have to fix that for you guys, but it's kind of cool because this is also, this battery is uh, 700 milliamp hours and uh, these cells are both each 3 volts at uh, 1400 milliamp hours. So this battery will last twice as long as this one. And uh, together those two batteries cost me about seven bucks. So I fixed the whole gun for seven bucks. And I didn't even have to put a new board in it. I can use this stock, the stock board. So I, I, I thought it was a pretty successful repair there. Pretty MacGyver-ish. Um, gun works fine, shoots, it rips. I'm getting about 12 or 13 on pure semi, and that's about as fast as I can walk the trigger anyway. I'm, I'm not that fast. My EMAG lefty, I might get 13 or 14, but um, yeah, that's about as fast as I can ever expect. So, anyway, uh, thought I'd show you guys the MacGyver in me, and uh, talk to you later. See ya.